Simulating and testing target link code. Code coverage analysis. This video will show the following information. Target links code coverage test levels, measuring code coverage, code coverage reports, and annotated code listings. Code coverage tests let you find parts of the production code that are not executed and have therefore not been sufficiently tested. Target Link provides two code coverage test levels, statement coverage and decision coverage. It can record code coverage data for a part of a Target Link subsystem, for example, one selected for incremental code generation. For a complete Target Link subsystem, or even for multiple Target Link subsystems. To perform code coverage measurement with Target Link, use appropriate stimulus data for the model so that all relevant working points are reached during simulation. Then you have to build a simulation application for software in the loop or processor in the loop simulation so that Target Link generates and compiles the production code instrumented with the appropriate code coverage macros. After the build process, you can simulate the generated production code. Target Link records the corresponding code coverage data and optionally displays the code coverage level for each code generation unit as a percentage of code lines already executed. By varying the stimulus data and repeating the simulation, you can improve code coverage and thus test quality. To analyze the code coverage results in detail, Target Link lets you generate appropriate reports. They contain an overview table with coverage results for each code generation unit, as well as detailed annotated code listings with execution counts for each block, among others. Code branches that have never been executed can easily be identified, so you can adjust test strategies accordingly. Thus, code coverage analysis with Target Link increases the quality of your software.